Hey everyone, welcome to day three of Casablanca. Uh, it is a beautiful day outside. Um, and we're just gonna head out, go to maybe the Mohammed the Fifth Square um, and a few other things. Maybe check out the Morocco Mall. I don't know what we're going to do today, but uh, yeah, look, let's go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Right? And universities have to stay in business. And failing everyone is not really not creating smart yet. And be done with it. All right, folks, we've arrived at the Muhammad the Fifth Square. Uh, you can see the Sakhik in the distance there. We'll go there too, or walk around it at least. Uh, this place was made at some point in, or started being made some at some point in 1916. At the start of the French Protectorate in Morocco. Ryan Davidson is suitably impressed with my historical knowledge <laughs> of, of the place. That there is a court. What a beautiful building. We oui, Casablanca. What building is that? What build? Oh, wow. What is that? I don't know. Wait, let me find out. It is a beautiful day today. That, sirs, is the Grand Theatre of Casablanca. Do you want to see if they're playing Shakespeare? Yes. What? All right, folks, that is a square dealt with, kind of. We're going to walk towards the Sacre-Cœur uh, and see if we can find other things on the way. Very beautiful day. And the colors are just Changing stations yeah. for your babies. The sides of walls are very pretty. Folks, we're in the Arab League Park, which is close to the Sacre Coeur. Actually, you can see the thing from there. Close to the Mohammed the Fifth Square, just a short walk. And what a beautiful looking park, just trees and fountains and green things and other things. And Marcelo taking pictures. What could he possibly be thinking about? Let us know in the comments. He's still there. Two thousand years later. Still there. English gardens try and keep everything under control. And like well organized. Good. And then Italian gardens tend to let things sort of go naturally and on top of each other. French, I don't know. <laughs> so I think the French is the central part. Okay. According to that side, but I'm not remembering it. We have no idea. I really like Moroccan parks. I like I like the one in Rabat also. I like this one. I like everything in Ifran. I pretty much like all parks. But I think we're done with this one. We're going to go look at the Sacre Coeur from close up maybe because we can't go in. It's only open on the weekends. From what I've heard, we'll find out. 
but uh yeah after that i think it's it's the mall um which apparently has no air conditioning but does it matter or is it just people whining about it on the internet we'll find out Well, this is as close as we're getting to that. Yeah. Mall time. That in front of us is a hotel. But and that is some good, well-meaning Moroccan folk needing to stand in line in the hot sun during Ramadan just to apply for a visa to Italy. I feel you guys. I really do. We're in the same boat. By the way, that there. Where? So we've arrived at Morocco Mall, um, as reported, maybe the largest mall in Africa, North Africa. What's it? Let's citation find out. needed. Let's confirm. <laughs> Cit citation needed. In Africa, not just North Africa. Yes, happy to report no air conditioning, but not required at all. It is very cool in here. So uh, stop complaining. Hasn't. Who doesn't? That's because you haven't lived yet. Ryan, there's a coffee place here. If you want coffee, if you want to eat with the sharks, that is a shark. What's town team? I'm excited about town team. I say excited. <laughs> Flowers. Should we, do we need a bag? My old laundry bag was an IKEA bag, and I lost it. What do you mean? It's new faculty housing. Look. This is cool. Can you fit in there? No. No. Best. I, mean, I will. Best lamp. More clothes hanger. <laughs> Done with IKEA. And now begins our real mission, which is to find a red gel lava for myself. Will we find it? Let's find out. <laughs> when we come back to uh, Postmarker, to Ikea, mm -hmm. I'm going to buy one of those little hand models. We've done one more round of the mall, no Jalaba. <laughs> Will we have to go to the Medina? I think the Jalaba is the Medina. Oh wait, I see local looking dresses. My friends, we failed in our quest to find the Jallaba. And I don't know what we're doing now. We'll find out soon enough. The ocean is back there. Hey, 
my friends Jallaba failed one more once again it's a candid hotel uh, a very honest um, My friends, the road to the bookstore has been long and hard. We're about to get there. A few moments later. Deals. Yeah, it really is. Hmm? What door? there. Clouds. Oh yeah, I don't know. This sounds crazy, but they weren't there yesterday. They couldn't see them for the frame. Oh yeah. All right, folks. My phone's battery was about to run out, so I could not show you the books we got, but I can show you a beautiful sunset, which is right there. We're trying to figure out what we want to do for dinner. It is our last evening in Casablanca. Tomorrow we move to Tangier. And yeah, let's see what we come up with. For now, it is fifth. Do you check passport? <laughs> Look at my natural filter. <laughs> Dude, this camera is ridiculous. There's someone on the rooftop. How do we show this? Uh, uh. Alright folks, it's time to call it a night. We went to this place for dinner called um, Ahmed Chef. It was a Turkish restaurant. Beautiful food, absolutely beautiful food. Um, yeah, you should go there um, if you're in Casablanca. Then we ended up going to a store for my friend's uh, favorite football team um, in Africa. Um, so yeah, it was it was quite a fun experience. Today is unfortunately our last night in Casablanca. Uh, the next time you see us will be on uh, the Al Burak to Tangier. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Like, subscribe, uh, let us know in the comments what we should do either in Tangier or what we should see next time we come back to Casablanca. Uh, till then, from Dar al Baida, if I said it right, hopefully I did. Um, Slamo. Welcome.